Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Welcome to Lime Rock Park where we're going to be doing another rookie race on R Factor 2. This time we're driving the Radical SR3, you know, the proper Radical with the 1.5 litre bike engine. Now you'll have to excuse the war wound. Again, I've been attacked by a big soft Labrador. Note to self, never take your eye off them when you've got a ball in your hand. It's not blood, it's like a weird bruise that's bright red. Anyway, on with the race. So this is 15 minute race or so around Lime Rock Park. And we actually qualified better than expected. We qualified P5, but this thing is an absolute hoot to drive around here, but it's chaos. Now, again, I want to address something. Somebody posted in an R Factor 2 video comment section the other day, isn't it coincidence that Dave Cam is playing R Factor 2 when motorsport games are in difficulty or something along those lines? I'm like, what? I'm just a bloke who likes sim racing, racing online when you couldn't do it before. It's got nothing to do with motorsport games. So I'll race whatever's going. I don't care what simulator it is. R Factor 2, Race Room, iRacing, Automobile Blister. I draw the line at ACC. But any of the others, if I can race competitively online, I'm in. So whoever you were in the comments, I can't even remember your name now. Do us a favor, unsubscribe. Anyway, on with the race. 15 minutes or something like that. Start in P5 in the proper radical. Could this be the race that gets us our silver ranking? Well, let's get on track and find out. Right, here we go then. I'm actually quite nervous for this one. Lime Rock Park is always a bit chaotic, but in something like the radical, it's even worse. Before we get cracking, I want to say thank you to the video sponsor, Race Lab. If you like the look of the overlays on screen, please check out Race Labs in the description below. Use the code DAVECAM to get 10% off your first three months. If you want to support the people that support me, please check out Race Lab down below in the description. Right, here we go. Where's the lights? Oh, has he saved it? He has saved it. Blimey. We're still going. We're still alive. We didn't hit anybody. Starts all right. Time to get stuck in. Whoa! Always oh, struggle through there in practice. Go and get some real bad frame drops. He's going defensive. What oh, is sideways blindly? Very wide. Ooh. What? I just copied him. Under pressure from Javier behind. We had to go for that there, I think. Even though there wasn't much room. Sector 
Dalton in the morning some points. Tough. Oh, he's dead behind. He saved it. How did he save that? Well, these two are having a light ding dong in front, so. They might get dragged up to those when they start fighting. Going on. I must have something on in the background or something because the performance is terrible. I'm keeping them honest anyway. Go on, Kevin, attack him. Everybody okay? I just want to go down the dick there, that's when I get the performance issues more than anywhere else. Fight too hard and let Javier get back into it. No way, no way, no way. Javier's there though, point eight back. Kevin is that effect there.
but something's happened behind. Moon's got through. a bit too much talk at the top of the hill for me. You know when you go over the crest in fifth. A little bit too much talk so you get a bit more wheel spin. Bumper. You've got half your fuel left. How long's left? Just over five minutes. This is tough. So you don't know what incident points these guys in front are picking up either. They could be rocking them up like nobody's business. I need to close this up now. That's what we need, some mistakes. This is chaos. This is great for That's got to be a penalty for Kevin. Jeez, right over the curve. Keeping him honest though, folks. The 
can't make a mistake. If he does, he's in big trouble. As are we do. This Luke's obviously down quick. He out qualified us by quite a bit, so. Off the wheels there. Oh shit, it's too wide. Kick the tyres a little bit there and the braking. Gotta be penalties for Kevin. Surely. I think Gary's got this one in the bag now. One more lap, is it? Race though, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. P3 will take it. We'll take it. Well done. Decent drive. Is that going to be enough to get us our silver license or silver ranking? Will that be enough? I'm not sure it will. Let's have a look. So we got third. 17 laps, expected us to qualify 5th, we qualified 5th, we qualified in the top half of the results, expected me to finish 5th, but we actually finished 3rd. So, qualifying 6 clean laps, race 15 clean laps, the race 2 invalid laps. Unfortunately, we didn't do enough to get our silver safety rank. Let's check out the results. So, Gary got the win, Kevin P2, we got P3. Only one second behind the leader. To be honest, chuffed a bit with that. So there we go. Started P5, finished P3 again on our driver ranking and again on our safety rating. Although, unfortunately, we didn't do enough to get our silver license. But fingers crossed, the next one that you see on the channel will all go swimmingly and we'll get promoted. But that was a really tough race, that one. You couldn't make a mistake at all. Well, the guys in front couldn't, we were close. But the guy behind me, Luke, he was only a couple of seconds back. He obviously had a bad start. So if I made a mistake, it would have been right on us. But overall, really happy, good, fun race. So if you did like the video, please remember, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, please consider subscribing. As always, thanks for watching. Have a great week. See you later. Cheers.